Welcome back friends to Corona Trigger. So we are still in this Geno Dome. Uh, we're about to fight the Mother Brain. The one that's supposedly corrupting Air Robo's friends, trying to destroy humanity. And we had to kill one of his friends as well. And I feel so sorry. Anyway, let's go in and kill that bitch. That's that's her. You did well to come this far. Oh my god, so you have come this far <laughs> and still you understand nothing. I am the mother brain of the air RY series factory. Come Prometheus, you must once again join us. I'll reset your secretary and erase your memories. No, then we'll dispose of these filthy humans. I'm sorry, but I cannot afford to lose anything else. Not my precious memories or my irreplaceable friends. Aww, you do care. You're such a good boy. You would betray me to stay with these humans? You would turn against the family of robots? Yes. Humans have taught me much. Chrono, Marl, Luca, Frog, and Ayla. <laughs> what about Magus? <laughs> I will not betray my friends. Ho. Oh. Foo hoo hoo. This is rich. Don't make me laugh. You, you have emotions? I'll show you just how human you become. I don't get that. Alright, we need to kill the three monitors first because that fucking thing heals, the, heals her and she has like, I think maybe 6,000 HP? Yeah, kill this thing right now, Chrono. Because <laughs> apparently computers are enemies too. <laughs> All right, Robo, your job is gonna be just healing. Triple kick, triple kick. Nice. So that's that that does like five hundred per kick. That's awesome, man. I'm gonna keep using that because he only has she only has six six thousand HP. Alright, here we go. Luminaire. Ha! 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 Breakdown. Oh, yeah, that was easy. <laughs> Corona level up. Nice. Bro, me, the, us, why? Got the terror arm and the crisis arm. What's the difference? All machines in the factory have been shut off for good. Robo. Let's go. Good boy. <laughs> So, which one is better? Crisis arm attack changes below 8, 10 HP. That's not good. Terror arm then. <laughs> Alright, so the next side quest involving Sunstone. So, we're gonna do that. But first, I need to get more ruby vests, ruby armor. for Because it, the enemy for that side quest is gonna be annoying to, to fight. Uh, mainly because of the fire attack. If you miss, if you miss the wrong, if you get the wrong, if you hit the wrong one, I should say, uh, you'll get you'll he'll attack you with the fire attack. So yeah, it's very annoying. Um, uh, I'll probably I'll, I'll start farming the ruby vest, ruby armor right now. Uh, we'll do that in the prehistoric era. So, but I'll 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 uh. I'll just cut it 
you know, so that way I don't like, I don't know, it, it's not like a filler or anything like that. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll be back. This is the place that we're gonna go. So I'll be back and uh, with the uh, ruby vest and we'll do that one. So I'll see you then. Alright, so I'm back farming the ruby armor. Uh, the only way to get them is if you get 10 each of the uh, rub uh, fang, paddle, horn, and feathers in the prehistoric era. So this is, this is my party. We're gonna we're gonna be fighting this the uh, sun boss, whatever. Uh, ruby armor for both for all three of them. So yay! <laughs> and uh, yeah, I think we're ready. Let me go ahead and save. All right, here we go. Sun Palace. And it's doing the song again. All right. So this is actually gonna be a weird boss. So you'll learn. You'll see why. It's an eyeball protected by fire. So you don't want to attack the fi uh, all of them at the same time. No, 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 no. You need to make sure uh, you make sure you guess the correct one. Damn. No, that's not the right one. Alright, good thing I we have ru ruby armor. Nope, that's not the right one either. And since we have ruby armor, uh, we don't have to spend much time healing. <laughs> but that needs to be healed. <laughs> oh, never mind, it doesn't really do that much damage. Okay, that needs to be healed. Damn it! Okay, so it's the the one behind him then. Okay. There you go. So yeah, that's what you want to do now. After you guessed it, you need to attack the correct one. Make sure you don't spam it. What? What? Ah, damn it! <sighs> now I gotta find the right one again. This is actually not a fun boss. <laughs> nope, that's not the right one either. Damn, Frog needs a healing here. But if you didn't have a, a flaming defense at all, it'll, it sucks actually. Because he does a lot of damage with the fire. The creator who made this boss must really love trolling. <laughs> like this is the worst boss fight ever. Oh no, it's shuffle again. Fuck! Before I even before I even find out where it is. Yay, we got it. Well, it's a good thing that his HP is on. Ah, oh, damn. Right, because I... I yeah, whatever. His, his HP is only 2500, so it's not bad. But that fucking laser eye. Shit, man. Can I use Cure 2 on Chrono here? Okay, he has- Ah, damn it! Just as I was about to attack that thing. Fuck you. <laughs> so 
Seriously, the main, eh, the guy who made this fight must be like, aha. Uh -huh. This must be a really fun fight. <laughs> -la 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 oh well, this game's still the greatest, one of the greatest of all time. So I'm not even angry about this. No. Shit. Oh my god, really dude? Yay, we got it! <laughs> he is the son of sun. Wow. What a name. Jesus. Alright, I don't want to queue another time because I'm first just gonna fucking... Use roulette shovel on us something. Yep. Ah, can't follow it. I was trying to follow the movement, maybe I could, but no, I can't. Alright, I'm gonna wait until Ayla uh, to frog attack. Nope. Yay, the right one. Son of Sun is losing his fire. <laughs> then you're not a son, then. <laughs> Aha! 3800 experience points, nice. Dual attack, drop kick, triple attack, 3D attack. Oh shit, it's gonna do dot it. Dudley death death drop something like that <laughs> Yeah, the uh, 3d 3d <laughs> Test the ancient sunstone, but it lacked luster perhaps the Sun can rekindle it, but how long will that take? Oh I don't know maybe 65 million years <laughs> Uh, yeah, which is why we're gonna go to the pass. <laughs> It'll take forever, but you do realize we have a time machine, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go and use shelter first. I and mean, safe, I don't want to go through all that shit again. Alright, let's go back to prehistoric era. So, we need to find the Sun Palace, the Sun, uh, I should say, it should be on the, that island, small island over there, on the top. I think this is it. Sun keep, yep. Mm. 
this is the this be the spot tis warm leave the moonstone yes how long shall we leave it hither oh i don't know we'll go back to 2380 <laughs> all right let's go back to the future All right, so this is the Sun Keep of the future. It's gone! The Moonstone! It is gone! Yet it has not been taken recently. Let us, let, let us return in time. So, let's... Go back to 1000 <laughs> To the year 1000 Not much has changed but they live underwater <laughs> And your great 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 granddaughter She's pretty fine Alright let's go back to Sunkeep It's gone, still. Not here either. Has someone from this time taken it? No. Let's go back to the year 600. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look. It's here. So it must be year 1000 when we steal it. Power tap. So it must have been stolen in one year 1000. So let's go to the future and see what, who stole it and what kind of monster was still the power of the sun. <laughs> oh, I know, Doctor Octavius probably. <laughs> the power of the sun. In the palm of my hand. <laughs> uh, nah, actually, it's this fucking asshole in poor village. If you go there right now, you'll notice the his house is like shiny. Yeah, see, uh, well, not shiny. I should say sparkling for some reason. So if we go here and talk to the elders, like I'm fucking rich because I sold the sunstone. <laughs> Moonstone? Never heard of it. Liar. You liar, you. Dad loves money more than he loves me. Ah, okay. The person I hate most? My dad, of course. The children are slipping away from us. It's so sad. Yeah. Imagine having a marry a bastard. <laughs> Everyone says daddy's greedy. They're lying, right? No. He's right. <laughs> They're right. <laughs> Okay, so the kids hate them, the people hates them. Wow. You hit the jackpot there, buddy. <laughs> Alright, so let's go to the snail stop here. Which is in here? No. There it is. Alright, 400 years ago a strange metal creature helped a woman named Fiona survive the forest to the north. Yes, the creature was placed in a shrine within the forest. Yes, it's Robo, I know, because I was fucking helping him. <laughs> Everyone is over at the festival, what fools. You're a fool, if you don't know. I got the best jerky in town, but I'm saving it. You what, you saving it for Jesus? <laughs> I might let go. I might let go. Let some go for say nine nine thousand nine hundred gold. Uh, how about it? Yes, we have to buy this for something else, for a special occasion. You must be really hungry. Here you go. Do, 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 do. Some monsters coexist with humans like that piano player. <laughs> yes. 
Oh god, I love life. Alright, so now we gotta go to the pass in the 680 and tell the mayor to not be so greedy like your generation would. <laughs> like your descendants. So if you go to the elder's house here. Dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna marry Tata. No, don't. He's a pony. Pony. Next to the bed is a treasure box. Open it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The magic cave lies under a mountain east of Denadoro. Oh, that Tata. He's just lovable. No, he's not. I see you have some jerky. Would you sell it for 10,000 G? No, I'll give it to you. You're giving it away? I thought there were no kind people left in this world. Wow. Wow! You can bet my ass, my, you can bet your ass my children are going to learn the value of sharing. So yeah, after that, the descendants later on will, will be better. <laughs> So let's go ahead and go to the future and take a look. The poor village is not a terrible people, ter terrible person anymore. The poor uh, mayor, whatever. The person I like most, my dad, of course. Yep, they start to love him. You're interested in the moonstone? Well, someone simply left it here. It seems important to you folks. Why don't you take it? That's awesome. I love my daddy. <laughs> I wish my husband were a little less generous <laughs> and more giving to you. I get it. Everyone thinks dad's generous. Does that mean they think he's cool? Who knows? Yes, he's cool. <laughs> Not a total dick like last time. All right, so we gotta go back to the uh, sun keep because it's not recharged yet. So we need to go back there and have it recharge and then go back to the future again. And we'll visit that grave later after we're done with this shit. Leave the moonstone, yes. Now I gotta go back to the future and see what's going on. Alright, I need to switch and get Luca with me because he'll, ha he'll actually know what to do with the uh, sunstone. <laughs> so, Ayla, get out. <laughs> You're not that smart for this part. <laughs> Alright. There it is. Amazing! With this much energy, I can make a powerful weapon. Let's go back to my house now. <laughs> okay. And with that, we're almost done with the story, with the side quest. I'll modify the sunstone to extract its energy. Then we'll just vacuum it, pack it, in, pack it into a cartridge. <laughs> And it's finished. <laughs> you get one wonder shot. 
sometimes I amaze myself. Yeah, I know. You're so awesome. Take a look, Luca. I bought a bit of the sunstone to create something nifty. You got sunshade. <laughs> So uh, there is a, we can there is something else we can do with the uh, sunstone, but we need to do one more one uh, one of the other side quests, uh, which is the rainbow shell side quest. Uh, but yeah, uh, let me just get the uh, weapon for Luca here. Uh, I don't know if we actually she actually equip it automatically. Nope, she didn't. Of course she didn't. Holy shit! One hundred eighty-two. That's a big jump. Wow. Wow! I don't know what to say now. <laughs> Invokes triple tech, dark eternal. Sun shades, up tax power. Wow! Huh. This changes everything now <laughs> I don't know if I want Magus now <laughs> maybe I should bring frog Luca but I need to get her to learn to protect again though still damn it Ah, uh, it's fine. The next side quest will help us level up anyway, it's fine. Anyway, I'm gonna end the part here. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys very very soon. Stay safe and stay tuned. Later!